so I'm back. Hey everyone, I'm Silver. Welcome back to my channel. I um, that was an awkward intro. I'm sorry about that. So today, guys, we are here with the Dark Face, or what my predictions for the new Dark Face unit will be. <coughs> um, so yesterday, Saturday, on the 24th of June, I did this with um, some Cleric Sword Dragon. I don't know what the results are because it's still I'm recording these videos on the same day. I got a really busy weekend, so I don't know if I'll be able to get to recording at all. So I wanted to guarantee you guys had the freshest of content in doing this. So guys, as you can see here, if you want to read its skill at your leisure, it's not going anywhere. Um, we have Intimidating Mutant Dark Face. So I have come up with three names and a skill for the suit, for what its new unit could potentially be if it gets a future card. So what I mean is, as you guys know, a lot of units have been getting new grade 3 stride forms, i.e. another cop another form of it, but different. So the names I've come up with was Evil Mutant Darkface, and yep, that's its main name is Darkface. I've also come up with uh, Supreme Mutant Darkface, and Intimidating Mutant General Darkface. Uh, the Mega Colony, if you guys don't know, is a clan based around one unit type insect, and is sort of hive military themed so I was trying to come up with a name I couldn't really come up with a lot of good ones so but I feel like its skills are much better in my opinion um, so refining its original skill of a counter blast to one during stride choose two units rest them you draw cards um, I, w I like to think this is, would be an auto vanguard skill the counter blast to one when you're G unit strides you may pay the cost if you do Choose two of your opponent's rear guards. Those units cannot stand during your opponent's next turn, and they cannot be called over. They also can't use their effects. Essentially, forcing them to be stuck at rest, which in my opinion is fantastic, phenomenal. It's just amazing. And then if that's the case, I've also come up with a GB2 skill. Um, when a when a player's turn ends, you may Soul Blast 2. If you do, draw a card for every unit that is resting. So why is this skill good for GB2? Well, um, if you and your opponent both have 5 uh, units resting, that's a total of 10 cards you can draw off of paying 2. Now that is going to eat through your deck significantly, so I don't know how well I actually like the GB2 of it. Um, originally, I, I, like, I, mean, I like the original card overall. But I couldn't think of a lot for this. It was actually really hard. Being that I'm just getting into playing Mega Colony. I just built a deck recently. So yeah. I'm going to continue trying to make it better. But um, we have no Mega Colony release support yet for the upcoming future. So this is going to be a very interesting one. When and if we get it. And I'm hoping we get something interesting. Um, maybe... The only other skill I could think of is a counter blast for stride. She's two rear guards, uh, permo rest or paralyze, I guess is what you call it. So they can't stand, they can't use their effects, they can't be called over. And then at, end of, at the end of your opponent's turn, you may draw a card for if those units are resting. So it's instead of making a potential for them to be called over a stand, you permo rest them and or you paralyze them, and then you get the draw. And then for another GB2, maybe Soul Blast 2 or Soul Blast 1, when your opponent calls the unit, you may rest that unit. And something like that. I don't know. I, I like its GB2 skill, but I feel like it does consume quite a bit of finite resources with the soul. But um, this video isn't really long, guys. I'm sorry for that. Like I said, this was sort of a put together video it came to me on the spot and I really wanted to record it see what you guys thought so as always later this week I want to compile all the unique skills and names you guys come up with and put them into a video so if you guys have different thoughts on what dark faces new card would be if he gets one and what his new skills would be comment them down below share with your friends and family anyone that will watch Vanguard ca ca content Wow I can't speak today content and enjoys Vanguard content so that I know that I can continue doing this. Um, we're at 124 subscribers now. I'm, re I'm going for 150 
by the end of well not by the end of this month but how about the middle of July if we can get to 150 that'd be phenomenal guys It'd really mean a lot to me but guys until next time I've been the Silver Wolf I will see you all later peace